And we got a Niv. <laughs> Jace. Yeah, that's another triple blue, though. He's really bad, like, without it. That's something to consider, though. Turn 4, Jace. Turn 5, Yagamas Mile Offering. Is a thing, I guess? I don't know. At that point, it'd almost be want to be running, like, Lazav to then copy... No. I don't know. At that point, you're just running a bad Grixis Legends. Hey! Keep. Nice. <laughs> CGB again. I hope I get to cast this against him. No turn two thought erasure. He's gonna have it though. Aw oh, man. <laughs> you caught me. This is any target, right? Okay, cool. <laughs> What do you mean? This is the most castable card in my hand. <laughs> Alright, well at least I can keep his Planeswalkers under control a little bit. I need a Discovery Dispersal. Or a Land. One of the two. Hello. Doesn't have a counter spell. I do like that Niv Mizzet as well. He seemed scared of it. So we can draw this naturally next turn, and this can hit us the next land drop, and then hopefully we can just draw another land or some action. Shocked, but didn't play anything. It's odd. I will take the Sarkon. Please resolve. Very good. Whispers of your dim I know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh yes, okay. We just need to hit a land drop now. He probably has a contempt or something. <laughs> oh lame. Super lame. Now I don't have no way to get him in the yard. <laughs> Ugh. Well, Tyrant Scorn is good against the mass cards. Well, that's a bummer. Uh, once again. Um. <sighs> Get rid of the Niv Miser Reborn. <laughs> Witness a moat of my power. Well, that's a bummer. <laughs> Alright, so I have 5 mana, so I can concoct back a Niv, and then that'll get me a card, too. 6 mana. Ugin can't kill this, so that's good. Do you think he has it? Do you think he has it? I don't think he has it. I think he has a counter spell. I guess he has a counter spell. <laughs> oh, come on, CGB. Finally beat the first phase of Demon of Hatred. Is that a Sekiro boss? I haven't been able to play much, Shellen. The only boss I've been able, or the first I've gotten so far is um, the Drunkard dude. 
The really fat dude. Spits poison. Uh oh. That's a 7 7. Okay. You battlefield. You hand. I would like to draw one land drop, please. This deck's actually kind of working a little bit. And then we get to draw a card off this too. Alright. And we got one, two, three, four, five. So Beacon Bull hits for five. That's pretty cool. Best I could find would be like an Esper deck with Dragon, Self Mill, and Primeval Scores or Birth. <laughs> Deep in Jank territory. Vanilla of Eternity could be good though. I mean, hitting for 10. That's pretty rough. Well, I get to draw a card off of him, so that's good. I can Tyrant Scorn him and just draw a card off the horde. It's not terrible. If you can make it indestructible, I want to play around that. <laughs> okay, so in that case, why doesn't tell me how many cards I have in my graveyard? So it's one, two. Three, four, five, six. Not good enough. That's unfortunate. Alright, guys, I just have to bedevil him. I want to save this for a planeswalker, but I can't take another seven. Drop to make sure Sarkhan and Niv can work out. Okay, that's pretty good too. Spell, please. Okay, cool. No sword can pierce my scales. Madness. <laughs> what madness? I need to save this in case he plays another bolus. Sorry, I'm getting silent. I really want to win <laughs> with this janky deck. Bob Saget. Although, with this, we can play Niv and then just immediately draw the card. Never mind. This is gross. At least we didn't get we got rewarded for keeping it in hand. That's actually pretty good. So he had a dead card anyway. So now we're 
Last color of mana off from casting Niv. But if you didn't have this much Planeswalker hate, we would have totally cast all our Nivs. Drawn quite a few cards. Oh, that's rough. Ah, it's such a bummer. Our deck was working, man. It was doing something. So I guess I need... I really like to connect Concoct there. Discovery Discursal also puts him in the yard, so that's good. Four, five, six. Maybe I cut expansion explosion for another knife concoct. Is that too janky? Seems pretty janky. Let's not do that. Let's just try another game. I was top decking pretty well with the uh, rampage though. Watching that on both sides, about one step behind, but quite close. Dang. Sonova, what? Thank you again for the sub, 12 months, dude. I really appreciate that, especially since I haven't, you know, been super consistent, but thank you, a whole year. I missed you, I missed your, your birthday. <laughs> the day you were born. But yeah, thanks, man, I'm honored. Yeah, one step behind, but we'll get close, yeah. Thank you, Helen, I appreciate that, man. Yeah, I was just, the whole time I'm thinking like, man, I just gotta be able to get a Niv down and then cast a spell, but didn't work out. Is that alert still there? <laughs> but yeah, welcome to Novo. Why is that still there? Just gonna put that down for a sec. <laughs> Man, 12 months. I do not deserve that. It's probably an accident. Like it. Da -da 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 -da. That's true, been quite a while. Honestly, but yeah, thank you so much. Uh, Tyrant Scorn doesn't seem good here. How you been? <laughs> Trying to be able to do it more often, but you know, life. Top deck most of the answers of the turn you had your threats that close, basically dang. Dang, well I appreciate that one. I want to send him a GG. Yeah, I mean, but I drew Anglis Rampage off the top quite a few times, so I'm definitely not going to, like, complain about it or anything. Hey, do you think he has the counter spell? I think he does. I can be patient. Okay, he was off. That's neat. Do you think the opponent plays counter magic? On a peak, the weight is killing me. Be battlefield. I sort of want to check it by playing a sabotage here. It doesn't feel like it though. Like a rock. <laughs> really showcasing how the card is gonna help litter, litter blossom. Bitter blossom. That's correct. It is not. Okay, Take now it. we got this. Very astute. You want to play more stuff? No? Oh, yes. We get to do it now. I guess I can convince the enemy. Ooh. Ooh, you guys ready? Let us fight! Look, 
Blue, red, black, white, green. And they said it couldn't be done. Knife concoct. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, now we're talking. Oh, come on. I just want to peek. The weight is killing me. Guess we'll hit another land drop. And then discard a land drop. Discard a beacon bolt. He said dice, he respects it. Woo! Dang dang dang. Heck, yizzity, yeah. <gasps> yeah, I really appreciate the recap, Solana. That's great. Oh. So he was Grixis all along. Contentious playing in a Grixis deck seems odd. Is he just straight up going for the ultimate? Let's get the chance to see you stream again. Yeah, thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Hype for War of the Spark. Oh, I know, right? What decks are you looking forward to? Hello. Uh... So if I play this, right, one, two, three, four, and then I can have three mana, it's not quite enough. I want to be able to play Niv and Rails Outburst, so instead I'll just play Sarkhan, I guess. What I should have done is played Niv, no, because it would have activated him, played Niv and then looted, but this isn't bad either. May discard a card if you do draw a card. Perfect. Watery grief. Now this, <laughs> this is a board presence I can get behind. Ooh. Grixis control. Yeah, I feel you. Pretty much for everyone. Angel Maldita taking a pull. Okay, what's your favorite card from the new set at this time? Oh, that's so difficult. Um. Oh, and he has the abilities of all my dudes. I forgot about that. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Um, I'd have to say either the new Sorin or honestly, I want this new Sarkin to be good. Either the new Sorin or maybe Storif. Uh, Sorin Vengeful Bloodlord, that one. Signs indicate that that hurt. Signs indicate that that hurt. Well done. This doesn't count as drawing a card. Come to me. Blue, red. I just like recursion threats, you know? Oh, I could even just plus him, though. Oh, that's so good. Oh my gosh. You guys, I love this deck. This new Sarkon might be getting up there too, though. I might just be a little too hyped for the set. Who knows? Cool, thanks. Yeah, of course. Thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. <laughs> okay. Um, let's activate your ability before I forget it. Get a water grave. <laughs> this is pretty cool. I'm I'm really digging this deck, guys. Sacrifice the creature planeswalker. Sacrifice the Niv because I can get it back with concoct. Wait, no. Target you. Uh do Rails outburst. Some extra damage. Should be lethal if Sarkon lives. If he counters it, he's definitely dead. You're a degenerate. I don't know if about degenerate Snowfall. I think it's just... Obviously, if it's Bulls' last set, they should push him. And he is pushed, and I I don't blame you one bit. I'm super pumped. I love the card. But, yeah. Honestly. It's, uh... The art on that is enough to make me want to play it, you know? Oh, that's brutal. 
he'll ditch the Rel, because now I have lethal. Unless he has moment of craving. I summon you. This is so cool. Man, this is so cool. Oh, I can see the animation well. And actually against a creature deck, this whole setup might be pretty sick. You know? I would have been burning them for... Oh no, because they go back to Planeswalkers. I would have been burning them easily for like between 2 and 4 damage though. Every time they attack, that's pretty sick. Whew. Dang. I'm really digging this deck though. Put on sleeves like it deserves. Alright, let's play another game. And then I think it's probably gotta be it for the day. I just wanna have a little bit more. A little bit more footage, you know. For the decks. Um, Grixis, Niv, Reborn. What is it, two and one? I think. Eh. The sleeve's so sick. Hey, nice and boat. Where's that from? Looks like it's from day nine. Dang. But yes, Nova, is there anything else you're playing or just Grixis? I've played Sandwich at least like 20 times. At least 20, not exaggerating. Exactly 20. I mean, Grixis is probably the most day nine. Heck yeah, I got it. If I draw one more land, we're good. Chris is obviously going to be the most competitive, I would say. And I'm just, man, I can't believe we've been subbing 12 months, man. I just feel bad. I'm just humbled. And honored. Rails Alper seems pretty cool, too. It's going to feel real bad against any gruel deck where all the creatures are huge. Uh, let's go Dragon Skull Summit. Okay, Sarkon? Can I discard an outburst? This. That's not bad either. Play land, play horde, play bullets. Can't play anything yet. Looking forward to trying stuff out tomorrow. Got you. Wait, tomorrow? I thought it came a lot later. Play this, I have two mana. And then, yep, here we go. They are coming. Blue, black, I guess. So you can hit him down to one, which I'm fine with. I just want to get a card off this, pull this into play, then I can rampage him if I want. Pretty good. Alright, cool, man. Yeah, I don't know. I just had, I had like 15 brews, so I'm like, I was so excited for everything. But it's really cool. I don't know. I just have a hard time settling on like one playstyle that I really like. That hurts my soul. Okay. So that's a thing. This is also a thing. Are you ready? Green, white. I don't think he's ready, Sarkon. <laughs> I mean, it might not be the most optimal build ever, but... It feels pretty good. I need to hit a land drop. That's not a land drop. But now I have the cards to kill both of these two, so that's fine. Whew. But it's 5.15 a.m. 24.4 here in Greece. 24 hours from now, it's going to be morning of the 25th. Oh, got you. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Dang. Are you watching me early or late for you? Like, have you stayed up all night, or are you getting up early? That's crazy. Uh, I wish I could draw another dragon. That would be nice. Man, Dragon's Horde even triggers off of this guy. That's sick. Okay. Okay, let's not get our paintings all in a bunch. Um, we have a lot of Sarkons. Let's pay two life. 
Play this guy. Minus. Now Fibblethip can't get in for damage. Draw a card off of this. The synergies are flying, boys. I may discard a card. What do I want to discard? Rell's Upper seems bad here. So let's get rid of that. Another land drop. Nice. <laughs> oh man, stayed up all night. I was traveling today. Late night bus ride. Dang. That makes me even more honored that you're here. I appreciate that, sir. Hopefully it wasn't too bad. Was it a fun journey, at least? Or was it just a basic commute waking up in nine hours? Oh, no. That clock's even wrong. Dang, man. Well, I'll be sure to... Uh, I work a long shift tomorrow, but at the end of it, I'll be sure to highlight all this and put it on YouTube so it's easily digestible for you. So you don't have to be up late watching it. <laughs> Dang. Alright, cool. So, yeah, I guess it's like a day and a half. I know it's Thursday. Thursday the 25th, I believe, this one comes out, so that's awesome. Your My Niv. Is pointless. pointless? How dare you? You're a monster. So I don't get to kill Fibblethip. He has to attack with everyone to make sure they die. I could plus him to kill the... What's his face? I will consume you. Um, yeah. We'll probably still just have the devil, though. This is four color? Man. Let's draw a card off this real quick. See if we can have a dragon to cast now. Okay. So then I can just... Why could he even just Angros Rampage him? One, two, three, four. Not quite enough to kill him with Rowl. What if I Tyrant Scorn? And then that's four? No, that's not enough. Thinking. Uh. Okay. I'll show you unhinged. So I can do this and ditch the Tyrant Scorn. Play Rawl. Kill the Kefnet. Ooh, a battle. I'm all tingly. Hold this lightning rod. And then attack for eight. They are coming. This ability seems is way better than I thought it would be. Like, holy crap, dude. Oh, man. Do you think we're going to see a competitive four-color deck? I do, actually. I If there was ever a four-color deck, I think it'd be this combination. Either Esper splashing black or Grixis splashing white. Pretty much Bolas and Teferi are going to be friends. That's what I think. Playing him in a four-color deck seems ambitious. Dude, this deck's doing it. It's even beating control decks, which I wouldn't expect it to. This is actually, like, the one I'm most excited for now. Okay, we gotta... Now we should end on a good note. What do you guys think? One more game? Let me see. Do you guys think we should play one game? Do you want to see it? <laughs> this jank pile that's doing work. Grixis and Niv. Just want Bolas to be good. Oh, he is good. Even just playing him as a 2 for one multiple times will wear you down, as we saw in that game against CGB. Oh, I love this. And like, one Rowl seems like the perfect number two. I just think we need- if I- if we had like a blue-red spell equivalent to like Justice Strike, that would go right here, I think the combination of things for Niv to find would be perfect. Man. That's great. I mean, I wonder, you know, like, let's say I pull out niv -Mizzet and just add another original niv -Mizzet and then, like, a Sarkon or something. Like, would this deck be better? Like, maybe? I don't know. 
I kind of don't want that to be true, so I don't think I'm going to test it. Ow. Stab myself with something really sharp. That was unpleasant. Hellcat MTG. Alright. That's a good hand. We have this to find this dragon or dump it. Just to get it back. I want a knife concoct to be good too. So that's something. I think if Bullis cost one black, black, blue, red, I think he'd be like crazy broken. Not crazy broken. I think he'd He'd definitely be good enough that I'd be playing him everywhere. <laughs> that triple black is kind of rough sometimes. Uh, not having sweepers is going to be rough with this one. Just want one land here. Dreadhorde invasion is kind of rough. Black white, huh? So Sarko will probably live. It's pretty good. Let me discard a card if you do draw a card. Rawls <sighs> Artburst is probably just too expensive for me to play. Ooh, that's a rough one to draw. That's one I wish I could have looted away. Maybe just shouldn't have looted something. I want to see Treadhorde Invasion in action. It's been okay. Not amazing, but okay. Alright, so now that he survived. Might demands power. Fight. Let's see if we can get him as a blocker. Now if he lives, I get to play Niv Mizzet next turn. Seems pretty good. <laughs> He's like, what am I playing against? And he can't attack with just these two to kill him. So I'm gonna have to be able to block Midnight Reaper. I mean, even just him drawing two cards a turn is pretty good. Five minus six six. Turn four. It's not too bad. Me being on the play was a big deal. You bloody demon. I was hoping you'd at least kill him so I could bring him back. The the dragon dragon cock. Does not lose. Wow. That's bold. If I had a bulls here, that'd be pretty good. Nope. And then I guess I'll just Tyrant score him now. I want to save this, because I feel like he's going to have like a Gideon or something, or a Liliana. But this card's okay. I wonder if I could just kill him with it, this game. Just never let him get a zombie big enough. So many legendary BA characters in it, it makes the game look like one of these anime style over the top card games. Oh yeah, or like kind of like um, Hearthstone, because Blizzard is all just like, you know, crazy dudes. Oh, okay. That's an interesting card to have. Oh no. And this is where I need a sweeper. Let's play Summit. Blue, red. Perfect. Pass the turn. And I have Knife Concoct as well. So that's fine. Like from a graveyard? Okay. Sure. Okay. Get the feeling he doesn't have the interaction. 
Maybe. Maybe I should just kill Celebrant as soon as he played it. Sure. Well, that bites. Oh, wait. So I can't save Sarkon anyway. So... Do I bounce him to my hand or do I kill a Midnight Reaper? I guess I'll bounce him to my hand. Seems like he's gonna be pretty important. Attack down Sarkon. These Midnight Reapers are brutal, man. One cry of the Carnarium would... would get me back on track. The bounce was the play there. Thanks, man. I was hoping so. Um, I don't know if there's any play here. I can go Dragon's Horde, connive, and steal the Cruel Celebrant, but that's bad. I think I just have to play the Niv again. Just hope to untap with him. Quill Celebrant draining them makes it harder to kill him with this and the Midnight Reapers. Alright, this is where Angress Rampage is good. This. It's a sad time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't want him to draw cards from the Midnight Reapers or get anything back with Soren. Wow, I'm at five. So I have to kill Cruel Celebrant next turn. Get my gutter bones for one with Soren. Or ping me for one, it's probably better. <laughs> okay, that works too. Yep, he's good at getting back gutter bones. Quite a good draw. Sack of Planeswalker, and then Beacon Bolt twice. It's kind of rough. We'd have to go to one for that. I will clear his board. And then any cool celebrant just kills me. Oh wait, no, okay, this is fine. Now I can do Angress Rampage. And then with the trigger, Nibble Trigger first. <laughs> He's got so many cards! Can I have Rampage? Uh, if I could steal a Midnight Reaper. I just have to hope <laughs> I can outvalue him or something. You know what's funny is if I had that 5 mana cost Sarkon, like, he wouldn't be able to attack me with much, you know? I would have shocked down his whole board, except for the Amass dude. <laughs> Does he have a Bantu? Bantu's all you got, I might have a chance. Oh. Hello, Polis. He's looking for more cards. Why would you need more cards? What could you have of ha having that many cards in hand? <laughs> w 
What could you need? Another tribunal? Plague Crafter. Now that's a good draw. Two, three, four. So I could play Bullis and bring him back. Or I could bring him back. And then Beacon Bolt? That seems better to me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if I play this, I go down to seven. That's five and then three. Does that work? One, two. Three, four, five. No, I think it puts me one short. Yeah. But if I just play both of them, then I'm dead to a removal spell. <laughs> I guess I want to Rowl over another niv it? I don't want to draw another bolus. Bring back a Niv. Yeah, I can't play Dragon Tord and Beacon Bolt. But yeah, I just really want to make sure I don't die so as much as this pains me. Kill the mass token. Oh my goodness. That is rough. I think Dragon Sword is really janky. Has it helped you at all in the games you've played? It's helped a lot. It drew me, I think, three or four cards against in the game against Oh no. Covert go blue. I should have binned him. Now I can't kill another creature. So I can't even try to kill him. Oh, I lose. Good game. That's rough. Um. But yeah, also it's just, I don't know, it's just another engine. Just good. I think, but yeah, it might not be good enough because it doesn't actually let us cast Niv. We need Sarkon for that. Please stop, Sparky. Um, it also works really well with Sarkon's dragon tokens he makes. I don't know. This deck is just a blast, though. That's all I know. Quick says Niv Reborn is at 3 and 2. Capture my feelings entirely. Alright, well, it was an honor to have all of you today. Navi sounds so lonely. <laughs> She's been desperate ever since she was missing in Breath of the Wild, you know? Oh man, but it's been an absolute pleasure, everyone. Thank